Back in 1999, several European countries got together to form a common currency known as the euro. For years, the same idea has been kicked around on this side of the pond, uniting the currencies of Canada, the United States, and Mexico. Some people think it could help things like travel and trade across the borders, while others feel it could diminish our national identity. So, what do you think? Our question, should North America adopt a common currency similar to the euro? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, there's something about the Canadian dollar that I'd be, I wouldn't want to let go, especially now that it's worth something. Uh, a common currency doesn't work too well. The, the uh, European common market, there was a lot of losers in that business. There was some winners, but a lot of losers. And we just might be a loser if we made a common North American currency. Okay. Sir? Yeah, I think the same thing. The if the U.S. in the situation it is now financially and, and we're not in the same position, they're just going to take us down with them. Mm -hmm. So I'm against it. No, definitely not. We are Canadian. The War of 1812 and the American Revolution, we defeated the Americans. We are Canadian. I am not an American. I am a Canadian, and we should not have the currency with America. I don't want to be bound together too close to the Americans. I'm a Canadian. I guess so. That would be pretty cool. Yeah? Why do you think it would be cool? I don't know. It's just weird to hear about like the U.S. dollar and the Canadian dollar like changing and to read the price on like a book or a magazine and in the U.S. it costs like ten, like $5 cheaper. So it would be nice if it was all the same and we could all have the same currency. I don't think so. I don't think there's a, enough of a major leap. I think it can coexist. You, you, think, you think it's good as it is? Then, yeah, pretty much. Okay, what do you think about a common currency? I don't mind having everyone having their different currencies. It makes it, it, it makes us all different, and it, it's easy to exchange. It's not like it's that hard to exchange currencies anywhere, so no. Okay. Um, this is kind of a tough one. I was talking about it the other day, actually. Um, I think that it has its benefits both ways. No. Okay. I don't want so. Um, just because there, there's always been issues with uh, unifying certain countries to one dollar, um, and I think it sets other countries apart if they do have some sort of other currency, uh, other than w being mixed in with everyone else, the big melting pot. <laughs> to make it easier for trade and stuff like that, yeah, I think so. And like the difference between the dollars, I think it'd be so much better if we all just had one thing. So you think the economy would run smoother? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah, I think the same thing. Since we're pretty much on par with the American dollar, it'd just be easier if we didn't have to um, transfer money. Transfer money, yeah. Okay. okay. Well, like what they said, like if we're on par, it would make sense. Like just being all equal instead of having to do a lot of exchanges and such. No. Why? Because uh, I think we ought to have our own policies and be able to keep our own policies. Mm -hmm. uh, right now, the United States currency doesn't look very strong, does it? If we didn't, if we didn't attach ourselves to them when we were at 62 cents, we certainly don't want to do it when we're at par. I don't think so, because um, well, they have their own economy, and if the currency is same, there's not going to be any difference between the economy. They can't really make any difference between the economy, and, and the currency is the only way they show the economy difference. You know, mm -hmm. so it should be different because okay. they're they have their own country. They should have their own currency. Okay. I agree. It's for our own country, we should reflect that by having our own currency. I think it may make sense for the U.S. and, and Canada because the economies are so tightly tied together. I think uh, the Mexican economy is probably a little bit uh, different in, uh, in the way that it operates from the other two, so it might be a little challenge. I think we've got a good system here. Yeah? You're happy with it as it is, eh? Okay, sir. It's, uh, money's money. It all works out in the end, you know? It doesn't really matter what we deal with. Interesting, because we have a, a, a three-country free trade agreement. But no, I don't think so. I think the euro is in a market. The common market is, is quite distinct from the NAFTA market. I mean, we're dominated by the U.S., although our currency is basically at par now. But in Mexico, I don't see that. There's different cultures, different uh, linguistic differences, which I guess in Europe aren't a big deal. Everyone speaks four languages. No, I don't think that we're ready for that. I think it's a little premature. That's an interesting question. <laughs> I think that uh, you're going to get into issues of uh, culture, issues of nationhood, 
Uh, I think it would be a very difficult thing to have happen, but I think in terms of a, uh, in terms of a north of, uh, in terms of a trade zone, I think it does make sense. Maybe not right now, but maybe in uh, 20, 30 years, it might make sense. I think Canada and U.S. are two separate to do that. I think in Europe it's a good idea because of the, the, the history of Europe to, to, to keep them united. Because of, but uh, here we want to remain sovereign in Canada and keep our own currency. We don't need to be, uh, have one with the Americans. Yes, I agree with that. Yes. Okay. Why do you agree with that? Um, because it is stronger and it's a voice of many more than one country. And to have the power of, um, of more versus the power of one. Um, it's a better um, benchmark, I believe. I think so. It would make things a lot simpler. It would make us uh, work together better. Okay. Yes. Okay, and why do you say yes? Because I think, because being from Texas, I also am familiar with working with people south of the border, mm -hmm. that it would be very unifying to bring everything together under one, and then, of course, that would make workers' rights better between all countries also. Interesting. Sir, your thoughts on a common currency? Yeah, I would like a common currency. It would be easier to go back and forth. But I'd go for your currency because it's prettier. <laughs>